Welcome to GTV for February 27th. Now for the useless fact of the day. Whoop. Beethoven dipped his feet in cold water before he composed. Important stuff, y'all. All right, will everyone please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance? Begin. I, I pledge allegiance, allegiance to, to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may be seated, y'all. All right. Thanks for that little pledge. And now to Mr. Moore for this week's Lancer Pride winners. Mr. Moore, go ahead. You go. All right. What's up, you guys? We Improv is back. Improv, all three lunches. It's going to be by the auditorium. So come on down. We're going to play games, entertainment, and popcorn. Cool. Now on to Charlie Chaplin for your drawing. Take it away, Sam movie. Charlie Chaplin. <laughs> oh, hello. This is Mr. Bohr here. I just got flew in from L.A. I was filming a silent film. Uh, my brother, Mr. Moore, is in uh, Bermuda. I guess the suspense was just too much. He decided to fly back on Monday instead of uh, today. It's good to be here. Before we move on to the Lancer Pride drawing, which is exciting, we want to recognize our athletes of the month for February. We have a girls and boys basketball member. Unfortunately, they couldn't be here with us, but we want to, we want to, unfortunately, not fortunately, we want to recognize them anyway. So for the boys basketball team, McCall Moween, and McCall averaged 18 points, 10 rebounds, and five, five blocks for the month of February and help lead the boys' basketball team back to the playoffs for the first time since 2011. This McCall must be some player. Congratulations, McCall. Um, he's going to get either a Lagoon Pass or a gift certificate to Barbacoa. Our girls' winner is Eileen Angel, and this is what Coach Cousins said about Eileen. Eileen was a calming influence on the girls' basketball team. She ran the point guard position and looked to get everyone involved, both offensively and defensively. Eileen is a deadly shooter and hit big shots at big times. She also excels in the classroom, taking difficult classes, including AP, an AP course. So congratulations, Eileen, and uh, come see me when you get a chance. Now on to the drawing. Shall we begin? Ten names. The first student is Nagi Lai from Miss Gaskin's class. Nagi Lai, congratulations. Ni? Yes. Ni Lai. I want to apologize ahead of time if I mispronounce your name. Again, I don't work here at Granger like Mr. Moore does, and I know that he never mispronounces names. He never butchers them, does he, students? Does he? Next person, next student, Dallin Alarius from Mr. Ahmad's class. Dallin, come on down. That's a, an exciting time for you. Next one. Please don't fold them up like these. I have arthritis, and it's difficult for me to unfold them. Diana Medina from Miss, Mr. A. So, Diana Medina, congratulations. Next student, Malishka Mac, Mac Turk. Sorry, Mac Turk, Mrs. Bangit, or Mac. Come on down. Congratulations. Uh, I'm going to ask my... Okay, oh, we have uh, four more. No, we have six more. Oh, we have six more. Okay. Mackenzie Bon, Mrs. Gaskins. Mackenzie, I believe you've won before. Congratulations. Okay, let's make it interesting, shall we? Uh, 
Who am I kidding with that hat? Vyanka Haro. Vyanka Haro, Miss Gaskin's class. Uh, before we finish up, uh, it was brought to my attention that Mr. Moore cracked some of these jokes that most of the school's not amused, that nobody's laughing, that people are shaking their heads. Well, it's because my brother's lame, that's why. <laughs> The next person, Carlo Cardoza Jimenez, Mrs. Wood. Congratulations. How many more, assistant? Uh, the, the weather outside is frightful. Samuel Cans, Samuel Cans, Mr. Pace. How many more? Three more. Sierra Carter. Mr. Lewis, uh, suspense is killing me. Zanny Dumas, Miss Diamond's class. Two more. A little pretty pink one. Brooklyn, Miss Willahan. Brooklyn, if you know who you are, you're with Miss Willahan. Congratulations. And one more for the lucky winner. Marlon Brando. Just kidding. Teachers, you got that joke, right? Michael Avia, uh, Mr. Okison. Michael Avia, Mr. Okison. Congratulations to the Lancer Pride winners this week. Mr. Moore will be back next week. I'm out. Back, Angel. Just kidding. Right, thank you, Mr. Moore. Thank Angel. you. Thanks, y'all. All right, if you have not yet turned in your class selection cards, please turn them in by Friday, February 27th, which is today, to the Counseling Center. Let your rational side out and come celebrate one of the coolest numbers in history. Pi Day is March 14th, and this year it, will, it is Super Pi Day. There will be many competitions, and the winners will be presented on Pi Day. All right, here are the contests they are having. Reciting the digits of Pi from memory on Pi Day. Best poster or painting involving pie, pie eating contest on pie day, song about pie, video about pie, poem or poem or story about pie, and best saying using pie in it. Uh, Freddie, I gotta say, pie day is pretty surprising. <laughs> ah, that was uh, lame. All right, all contest rules are posted on the window of F211. If you have any questions, ask Mr. Clausen in F211. The pie day festivities will start at 8:30 a.m. Excellent. On a Saturday. All right, don't forget to dip your feet in cold water before you make those fire mixtapes like baseball. Okay, okay, wait, we have a question here. Got a question for y'all. This dress time. right here, is this gold and white or, or black blue and blue? Because this is ridiculous. This is gold and white, right? We should make a survey of this. This is gold and white. You know, All right, whatever. If you think it's white and gold, all I gotta say is you're stupid. Leave feedback. It's, it's blue and black, guys. All right, okay, thanks, that's for it for the announcements. Thanks, Deuces. Gold and white. Yes, 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 yes.